Hello guys! So it's Sunday morning and nakakain na ang mga bata. Um, uh, naglalaro na. So um, it's time for workout. So ito yung video natin today. Okay? Good so, morning workout tayo. Here we go. Alright, so tapos na yung 15 minute full body workout guys. So ngayon, 15 minutes lang yun. So let's aim for another 15 minutes. Gagawin natin ay yung gawa tayo ng standing ab workout. Okay, hanapin ko lang yung video. Ayan na, nag-load na yung video. So, mag another 15 minutes tayo para ma-complete yung 30 minute na workout natin. So, normally yung ini-aim ko lang talaga is yung cardio at ab workout. But, it's not limited to that naman. But, that's yun yung main focus ko. So, yung natapos natin, that's yung full body. So, that's like actually na-cover na yung cardio. So, ito, kasi medyo masakit ngayon yung lower back ko, so, the, uh, and normally yung mga ab workout, eh, yung, yung, you know, sit-ups and stuff like that. So, masakit yung lower back ko, so ngayon, gagawin natin is yung standing up na lang, pero it covers your abs din naman. Okay, guys, that's it. Workout complete. So, ngayon, magsi-stretch. Magsi-stretch out tayo ng mga maybe around 5 minutes. So, normally, pini-play ko lang yung soft music ko. Tapos, magsi-stretch na lang ako for maybe uh, around 3 to 5 minutes. So, let's do that. So, ayan, guys, pawis na pawis. You know, it's good to start your day, I think, with working out. But it doesn't mean naman na ginagawa ko siya araw-araw. Kasi meron talagang lazy days. And, um, tinatarget ko na mag-workout ng, ano, five days a week. Kasi, di ba, um, nasa bahay lang naman ako these days. And I actually tried na gawing six times a week. Kaso nagsusor talaga yung aking, ano, Ma-feel ma ma mo yung body soreness. So, I think 
at the end of the day, workout also means, you know, kailangan alam mo kung kailan mo ipapahinga yung, ano, yung body mo, for sure. Para ready ka na ulit for the next, um, you know, days of workout. So, magsistretch out na tayo, guys. And then, and then we're done. Okay. Oh. Whew. That's it. That's it guys. Natapos na yung workout natin. That's um two sets yun. So yung first one is um yun yung um body workout. Yun yung hit body workout. And then yung pangalawa is yun yung standing up workout so normally after ako mag oh, and and around three minutes four minute na stretching i guess so normally after ako mag workout eh um nag -pre prepare ako ng smoothie so ano ba yung nilalagay ko sa smoothie ko very simple guys because everything is right there ready na talaga kailangan mo na lang siyang ilagay sa blender sa blender mo. Let me just, ano, maghuhugas lang ako ng kamay. Ayan. Okay. Alright. Ayan na, maghuhugas lang muna ng kamay para in case mahawakan yung mga frozen food dito, eh, malinis na yung ating kamay. So, yeah, again, it's very simple. Ito lang siya. Blender is right there. And then, I use, ano, ito yung frozen butternut squash. So, oops, wait, before natin makalimutan, lagay natin yung blade. Mommy! Right there. Papakita Mommy, ko sa inyo. Look! Oh, oh, what did you do? Okay, so right there, guys, lagay natin yung butternut squash. It, it's really up to you how much you want, but to me, it's normally probably, ano ba, probably mga... 3 tablespoons siguro. And then frozen strawberries. Ayan. Oh, sorry. Uh, then, meron tayong frozen um, spinach. So, you know, some of us are ano, worried na naku, spinach, ano bang lasa niyan? But really, that's the only vegetable I have in it at yung butternut squash. And then the rest of it are really sweet. Diba yung mga berries. Tapos pagkatapos ito, lalagyan sa natin yung ano, mga banana. So, it really brings the sweetness more than, you know, whatever taste na hindi mo gusto sa spinach. So, and then ito. I think banana brings everything together. Kasi, ano siya, pinapatamis niya talaga. So, paminsan, kung feeling ko kulang pa ng damis, dinalinilagyan ko lang siya ng, ano, one tablespoon of honey. And then, you know, it's a healthier choice than whatever sweetener na gusto mong ilagay sa smoothie mo. So, there you go. Yan na. And then, um, dinalagyan ko rin siya ng, oops, let's see, meron din tayong, um, yan, Greek yogurt. So, mga siguro, um, mga dalawang, you know, whoops, tablespoons na Greek yogurt right there. Pagkatapos, eto yung granola mix. 
So uh, this is whole grain granola, oat, honey, and almond. So all together in this bag. Depende na rin sa'yo kung gaano yung gusto mo ilagay. And then, yeah, that's it. So, eto, pag ibi-blend ko na to, this is, ano, really concentrated. So, what I do is, ginalagyan ko lang ng konting, um, water. Yeah. Okay, there you go. Kasi, you know, we don't want it to be super concentrated. Parang, ang hirap namang inumin. Did I put everything? So, sige, naglagay tayo ng butter, uh, butternut squash. Meron tayong frozen spinach. Frozen blueberries, frozen um, strawberries, banana, one whole banana, um, ano ba yun? Greek yogurt at yung granola mix natin. So, there you go. Ayan. Ligayin siya natin. I-blend na natin. I could feel na may nakalimutan ako. At may nakalimutan tayo, guys. Ako po. What do you think? Oh my goodness. Nakalimutan natin lagyan itong gatas, itong almond milk. So, sige, that's okay. It may be too runny now, but it's okay. You still have all the nutrients. So, that's all that matters. There you go. Ah, yan. It's really too, ang, ang dami niya actually. But normally, uh, pinupuno kong isang jug ko, yung uh, blender bottle ko, um, which is, ano ba to? Gano pa karami to? Um, uh, does it say? Oh yeah, it's, oh it's 28 ounces guys. So this is 28 ounces um, water um, or blender bottle. So, yan, pupunuin natin yan. And then, you know, later, I can add again later. And normally, sinishare ko rin to sa mga anak. They actually like it. Dinalagyan ko lang ng whipped cream on top. And then, they think it's ice cream. So, na, na, uuto sila. And, you know, they're getting the nutrients kasi nauto sila. So, there you go. Eto siya. Let's, let's try, okay? Let's see. I'm not gonna like kung ano yung, ano yan, yung lasa niya. Mm. Mm. It's good. Yeah, it's good. You can... Hindi mo malalasahan yung whatever taste of spinach or maybe butternut squash na ayaw mo. Pero actually, yung butternut squash, it's supposed to be a little sweet. So yeah, it's really good. It's really simple. It's really healthy. So this is what I normally do after akong mag-workout. Ito lang siya. And then, like right now, it's ano na, 11.10 in the morning. So nag-start ako nag-workout. Ano ba yun? 10.30 ba yun? Around that time. And then, yeah, this should be... I should be okay with this until... 
maybe around 2 o'clock again. Magla-lunch na ako. So, yeah. So, that's it for today, guys. And, um, hopefully, sa next video natin, iba naman yung ating ma-cover, okay? So, today, it's, um, you know, waking up in the morning and then starting the day with a workout. Okay? Bye, guys! Oh, by the way, don't forget to subscribe and like the video if you, you do like it anyway. And then, drop your comments then and turn on your notification button okay sorry guys bagong bago sa youtube super so parang hindi ko pa alam yung ginagawa ko but hopefully today nakapag-share naman ako ng something na na you know something useful at um magagamit ng ibang tao dyan okay bye bye